I'm Jan Lever and I'm the creator and CEO of Jigsaw PSHE. Jigsaw started with this total desire and mission to try to make things better for children. My background as a teacher but also as a counsellor and psychotherapist meant that I could see a way or I thought I could see a way of bringing those two things together into um, a school curriculum. So I felt like we needed a curriculum so that there was a timetable slot every week for children to receive personal social health education but with a big focus on emotional literacy and mental health so that rather than just having the knowledge about healthy eating and exercise and relationships and so on they also understood themselves better and they liked themselves and respected themselves and understood who they were um, and knew also how to regulate their own emotions and so on so there was lots of different teaching materials available, but on different aspects of PSHE. What seemed to be missing to me was an entire program that were, had worked out the progression and the structure and what to teach at which stage and how to make it fun and enjoyable and creative, both for the children, but also for the teachers. been here for a jigsaw update on the new sexual education resources coming in and all the statutory guidance from the government as of September 2020. Kind of an update for the things we can expect, how to deal with any questions from staff and parents and children, how to update all our policies and guidance and support for that. Started up teaching through Jigsaw the PSHA, really going for the new second edition. It's been absolutely excellent. All the teachers are now teaching it every Monday, so we've made sure it's a teacher led activity every Monday to make sure it can be fully embedded throughout the school during the week. What Jigsaw has enabled us to do is to ensure that there's consistency right across the trust. So, on the first level, to ensure that all the children are getting a quality experience. Secondly, what has allowed us to do as a trust is to bring together the PSHE leads and for them to share good practice and ideas that have come about during each half term. A regular kind of lesson is more about like, I'd say more about learning, you need to do this, you need to do that. But Jigsaw Lessons is more about be free to who you are. The main thing that I enjoyed, or that I liked and that the school found really valuable about the Jigsaw resources was that it was all there and ready for the teachers to use. Um, the resources were really bright and colourful so the children were really um, enjoying them, really liked being getting involved with it all. Also they were really age appropriate so it kind of made the staff more um, comfortable and confident with using them because they knew that what they were using was relevant for the children that they were teaching. We absolutely love Jigsaw. We have fully embraced all that Jigsaw brings to our school. Um, we've got dedicated and timetabled slots every week across the whole school. We all do Jigsaw at exactly the same time. We love the resources because they're so, they're so child friendly. They've clearly been written by people who know children and who know what works with children. Um, they're all incredibly age appropriate, um, they're a good fun um, and the children absolutely love their weekly jigsaw lessons and then it permeates everything that we do throughout the rest of the school week as well. We all get to discuss our ideas together and it feels like it's a comfortable place and you're not scared to say anything. Basically what our Jigsaw curriculum does is it's preparing our children at Eastfield for life in modern Britain, in today's society, which is obviously very different to how it was when us as staff were growing up. So it's preparing the children in the correct way and making it throughout the years age appropriate for those children. Before we took on the Jigsaw, um, PSHE didn't really have that much of a um, of a hierarchy within the school but since we've taken on the jigsaw and it's taught consistently by the teachers and every single week then it has had a huge impact with the children. Now that we do the jigsaw lessons regularly the children love it and um, they're really enthusiastic they think that it's really uh, useful they're developing a lot of skills and the children uh, look forward to it every week 
um, and they're bringing it in at other times as well. So they also like to do some of the skills that they've got uh, in other lessons. So the children are absolutely, totally enthusiastic about the whole thing. They really enjoy the lessons. They like um, the interactivity. Um, the teachers um, really um, appreciate the time that they have to really focus on um, relationships and building those with the children. And it's also um, part of what we do through our assemblies and other things that we do in the curriculum. So um, it's really galvanised what, what we do as a school. I think it's made a difference to the children's relationships, how they build relationships um, to their emotional and mental well-being because they are quite happy to talk about whatever is being talked about in that particular lesson. In jigsaw lessons you don't get judged, you, there's no right answer and you can just say what you feel is right. Teachers thank us for having done this heavy duty planning for them. Uh, which saves them time, but what they also say is that it, it gives them permission to do what they came into teaching to do. So it, it almost, it almost, almost like it gives teachers, um, primary teachers particularly, it gives them almost that little oasis on the timetable where they can genuinely get to know their, their children on a deeper level which somehow over the years, all the other pressures had kind of eroded. And so they tell us they really enjoy that hour a week because they're, they're in it with the children, they're playing the jigsaw games, they're getting to know their children better. And because of that, everything else works better in their classroom across the rest of the week. Prior to using the jigsaw, um, materials. PSHE was taught um, quite ad hoc and it was sort of during anti-bullying week we'd do a little bit on that and just when events came up we would we would touch on certain elements whereas now it's a dedicated hour every single week where we specifically focus and follow the jigsaw scheme and I think it really does give the children a really broad approach and a wider understanding of the world that they live in and what being a good citizen means and how they can contribute to society and things in a really positive way. Um, so I do think it's enhanced their understanding as humans as well as obviously from an educational point of view. And I do think it will prepare them to be better citizens and better members of their own community. Definitely enhanced our PSHE um, provision. I think it's given us a clear direction. It's really, really shown us how amazing PSHE teaching can be, how valuable it can be, um, how important it is and as I say it's, it's massively raised the profile of PSHE within our school which is something that needed to happen um, and it's raised it both with the children and with the staff and really enhanced it. It gives the children a voice, they're, they're unafraid now to, to raise a subject which they perhaps thought might, might feel silly talking about but now they don't feel that way um, because it's something that's out in the open um, and definitely the relationships and the respect that the children have for each other definitely is the impact from us doing Jigsaw. We all sit in a circle and we all take it in turns to talk about things like what we would like to be when we're older and who we are and who other people are and how everyone's different and we're not all going to be the same. I think the fact that Jigsaw's used throughout Hull and the entire city has made it um, more cohesive for all of the schools to support each other and to talk to each other in terms of mental health and well-being and um, the skills that are required and needed for supporting all of the children of the city because um, previously it used to be very insular, you would speak to the people within your school um, and then that would be basically, you didn't really have anywhere to go with it um, or who, who, who know who else to speak to, whereas now the school are all, schools are all using the same language, we're all using teaching the same uh, skills and teaching the same topics at the same time. So it means that when children um, leave us and go to another school or when parents come in to ask questions about what we're doing, we can talk with confidence that it's, it's happening everywhere and the staff all know that it's happening everywhere so when you go to visit other schools you're all talking about the same thing at the same time, there's no mixture or confusion about what it, what, what it is that everybody's covering and everybody's doing. So it's made it really cohesive. 
a teacher normally sounds the chime first to get us relaxed. And then she says very calming, like calming words to try and get your imagination, like, like bubbling, trying to get it to come out. And we like do exercises with our mouth and like breathe in with our nose and breathe out with our mouth and pretend that it's different colours. Certainly our trust made a decision a long time ago that it would be our delivery model and with the support of Head Start we feel that we are Touchwood ahead of the game and that our children are getting a great experience. Well, when we get our jigsaw soft toys out, each year has one and when we pass it round in a circle, when we have a circle formation for talking and whenever someone passes it on, only they talk and no one else can talk and then they pass it on to someone else until it's gone all the way around. And um, because that way everyone gets to say something. So they're not just sat in a little corner being quiet because they're too scared that someone's going to like judge them or think that's not right. But in Jigsaw, you can, there's no right answer. There's no wrong answer. Say what you want, be who you want to be. I think my advice personally would be that we've, we've absolutely loved it and I haven't regretted a single second of deciding to go down the Jigsaw route. I would definitely advise that it, it's something to look at. It's, it's changed the way that we've done things and changed it very much for the better. So I would definitely recommend that it's something that everybody should look into.